Part two. Part two. We're back. I am back in front of a podium. This is our our ribbon cutting. Thank you. Everyone over there in the shade. It's like everyone's hiding behind the pillar from me. It's kind of funny. Um, there's ice cream at the end of this one, so it's going to be very short. So if you could all stand, and we will, I'll lead you in the Pledge of Allegiance. It's over here for those of you behind the. Uh, the I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Okay, thanks everyone. Uh, you can have a seat, those of you that are sitting. Um, I want to welcome you here. This is our ribbon cutting for our new county office building. And this, much like the courthouse, has also been a few administrations in the works. So we've got uh, some past commissioners. We've got our future, our existing commissioners. Future commissioners, listen to me. Um, <laughs> getting a couple years ahead of myself. Uh, and our delegations here as well. I introduced them all the last time. I'm not going to do it again. We're going to get this thing moving because we've got a meeting and ice cream, like I said. So, Todd, I'm going to turn it over to you. All right. Thanks, Greg. Again, a beautiful day for a ribbon cutting here at our new county office building. So. I want to talk about the building a little bit and uh, and the occupants that will be here. So first of all, this is a new 18,400 square foot building with a 5,400 square foot basement. And it now serves as headquarters for various multiple agencies here, including uh, the <laughs> Department of Planning and Zoning and Director Mike Kwasnowski is here, the Department of Community Affairs and uh, Faith Rossing is the director and she's here somewhere. Oh, she's manning the ice cream. Good. Okay. Our information technology group, uh, John Seaman, who is the director of that group, uh, and our own QAC TV7. And uh, I want to thank the guys here that are filming us uh, right now for the Channel 7 uh, network. And last but not least, we have our board of elections here, and Brittany, our election supervisor, is here as well today. This building was designed using sustainable features, including a state-of-the-art geothermal HVAC system, LED lighting, natural interior light tubes to allow natural light into the building and low use water fixtures. The building was constructed using metal frame, metal framing with a brick and hardy board exterior and the roof system is a certified Energy Star asphalt shingle. Some unique features we have here with this building. The new public meeting room space is equipped with state of the art information monitors and videography equipment. We have a TV studio here in the lower level for, for our two QAC TV7 folks. It also includes a secure, climate-controlled warehouse for our county voting equipment, which was, which was a great, great uh, ordeal for us to get done. But it is here, and I'm, I'm sure our election supervisor is pleased with that space. The site work provides 88 parking spaces using water quality, permeable brick pavers. Overall, this is a 37-acre property which was developed. This is our cornerstone piece, the county office building, but we have 1,800 feet uh, of new public streets with on-street parking, sidewalks, new public water and sewer lines, and a reservation of land that was dedicated to the town of Centerville for a future water storage tower, which will be right in the foreground where that uh, tractor is out there. The project also provides additional building sites for future commercial businesses here in the town and the, and the county, and it includes a new permanent home for the future Queen Anne's County YMCA just off to my right on this 20 acre parcel. That'll be our next project out here with, uh, with any luck. So we are all very proud of this new and attractive uh, building here in the town of Centerville and for Queen Anne's County. A few special thanks uh, that I, we couldn't have got this done without these folks. First of all, our project architect from Wheeler Goodman Massick, Jeremy Klein, he is here somewhere, there he is. And I know Jeremy took a lot of pride and workmanship into this, this job. It was uh, a great effort on his part. He's a local citizen here in Queen Anne's County, so he's uh, lived, works, and plays here in the county. Thank you, Jeremy. Lane Engineering, we have um, Keith, or um, excuse me, um, Rick Van Embert. I'm sorry. He's, he's here today. He's now, uh, he's representing Lane, but he now works with the town of Easton, I believe. Rick, yes. thanks for coming today, Rick. And the Mullen Contracting Company, and you heard those folks over there at our groundbreaking, but we have uh, President Joe Road is here, Rick Jackson, Project Superintendent, Dave Howe, our uh, Site Superintendent. So thanks, gentlemen, for a great job. I also want to acknowledge our partners, 
the town of Centerville, town of Centerville Town Council. I believe Jim Beecham's here and Tim McCluskey was here earlier. Yes, those are both here. And the town of Centerville Planning Commission, without whom we couldn't have put this all together on this beautiful site here in the, the town of Centerville. And certainly I want to thank my staff, uh, Chief Engineer David Ramanek and our project engineer Lee Edgar for uh, working on this project throughout the last couple years. And certainly I want to thank all the agencies that are now in this building. We had a lot of uh, interesting meetings to program the space, to make it work for them. And I want to thank everybody here that participated in that effort and everybody that a lot of folks I see are here that, that did participate with that. So I think we have a great facility here for the future here in Queen Anne's County. So that's, that's all I had to say. I think we can uh, move on with the, the ribbon cutting ceremony. Yeah. Okay. So we can put the ribbon back up. All right. There we go. Careful with that. <laughs> Ready? One, two, three. Hit them. Hey. Okay, thank you, everybody. We have ice cream inside, correct?